Um, yeah, I think we're just gonna try it. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna belabor the point here. We're gonna give Palisand a try, right? We're double ground backline. We're really hoping for Vigoroth coming in on the safe swamp. We're gonna absolutely dominate if we can Vigoroth. Uh, if we can get Vigoroth in on the safe swamp, so let's do it. Let's do it and see what happens. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. <laughs> it is what it is. All right, Catali, good luck, friend. What do you got? We got a bomb of snow and a charge bug. Okay. Charge bug's fine. Okay. Now the question here is uh Yeah, X scissor does that. Oh, they got the second X scissor there. Okay. Well, I'll, I'm not in love with where things are kind of shaping up here, but question here for my opponent is will they uh simply switch here oh no they're gonna let it go okay that's fine obviously that we want we want the vigoroth locked in place onto the palisand so we're gonna do it right we really didn't need that but that's fine oh hi okay Oh, they got the surf off. You know what? I don't even care. <laughs> Let's preserve that. Yeah, we're down two shields, but they're going to probably never be able to kill the Palisand, right? <laughs> so. And we're just going to farm this thing here. Getting out with a surf would be nice for them, but like, I just don't think it's gonna matter. Oh, okay. So here's the question. Can Vig kill us in the two shield? <laughs> Can Vig shield twice to kill us? Oh, that's pretty nice though. Especially because if we get a debuff here, the answer is definitely no. What's up, Fubat? How you doing? Yeah, they're not. They're not even gonna try. <laughs> GGs. <laughs> uh, so okay, good news. We found what we wanted. We found a Vigoroth in the back, most importantly, and secondly, we found uh, another Pokemon we could beat too. So that's a pretty good place to be, right? That I mean, the lead wasn't good for us, but the fact that they had a Vigoroth in the back. It's sand attack, Fubat. I believe sand attack is the correct answer. Whimsicott. Okay. Yeah, I mean, there isn't a lot that walls Vig here, so finding something that actually walls Vig is pretty nice. I mean, we're not shielding, right? It can't be correct after getting the icy wind in to shield a moon blast here. So, I mean, it means they have one counter to this, right? Oh, actually, we should have we should have stuck that out. We should have stuck that out because we're uh, we're in some trouble here if they decide to uh, if they decide to switch out, right? Which they will. There's no way they let me do this. 
right? <laughs> ah, I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay. We definitely need to run the clock here. A little bit. We can still kill the Talon Flame, right? Also, this misaligned switch timer here is really helpful to us in a lot of ways because it means that I can bring in my... Uh, we got like multiple debuffs too, which is great. I can bring in my Obama Snow. And they're not able to uh, really do much with this right now. Oh, they actually shielded. Fascinating. We're definitely not shielding. Oh. Oh, actually. <laughs> Good work, opponent. You came in and caught a icy wind. That's kind of funny. Okay. They have to throw both their moves. I don't think it's correct for us to go. I think we're palisanding here. As as awkward as this is. Right. We'll shield the next thing, but we will get a shadow ball here. We'll even get it before they get a move, so. And then the lantern's not going to be able to kill us through the shield. Okay. So we did beat the Talon Flame. It was a little awkward. I'm not going to lie. I don't love how any of this played out, but we did find a way. Um, we needed to let the Obama Snow probably just die. Um, so we could line up our Pokemon better. <laughs> but, you know... I also don't love Talonflame with like a couple incinerates as well as a uh, a boost, which is what it would probably have there into Wishcash. Like it's not the greatest matchup, so it was kind of nice. The sequencing paid off the way it did. No Vigoroth that time, but hey, we beat one of the more problematic Pokemon for us. We found a way. We found a way. The fact that my opponent didn't immediately jam the lantern uh, on the wish cache was pretty much a saving grace for us, right? Hey, I know this name. I know the Logan Mech name. Charge a bug. Okay. Yeah. Happily, we'll take the uh, the uh, debuffed move here. So, ah, into your own wish cache, a shadow cache, even. Okay. Well, obviously, we're pretty happy. One to be into the mirror with an energy lead because hitting a debuff here would be great there we go and then two um we've eliminated a major palisand roadblock for us right this thing obviously would be very good into palisand oh uh, they got a debuff too it's not supposed to work that way it's not supposed to work that way okay I'd like to maintain switch advantage if I can. Oh, they have mud bomb. Okay, so that's not that's not great for us. Okay. 
Don fan. Interesting. Okay. Shadow Don fan. What does this know? Body slam, weather ball, earth power, trailblaze. Okay, well, trailblaze, trailblaze is a problem. <laughs> trailblaze is going to be a bit of a problem for us, right? Okay. And that's going to be GG's. I was like, I'm either going to catch or they're going to die. So. <laughs> Works for me. Works for me. Body Slam, Trailblaze, and the Earthquake are the three most common moves. I, for I forgot it had Trailblaze. It's not the first time I've had it throw Trailblaze at me in this format either. It's just I forgot it had it. <laughs> again. I forgot I had it again. So. You know. Either way. Uh... Uh, Palisand's also really good into charge a bug, by the way. Something I realized as I was thinking about my matchups there. Uh, Skarmory is a problem, though, right? This is this is definitely a Pokemon we are going to struggle to beat, like across the board. I think I think that might be our worst lead, unless our opponent literally has no answer for the Wish Cash. Okay, debuff's nice. I mean, they also could just Brave Bird me, right? Brave Bird and Swap is a really reliably good play pattern for our opponent here. So I'm going to shield this. Even with the debuff on, I'm going to shield it. Oh, that's not what I want to see right now. I want to see that later. I want to see that later. So here's our problem. I really kind of need the wish cash to find a way to win this game, I think. But what we're going to do is we're going to do that. And then I'm going to just switch to Palisand. This is still locked. Yeah, we've been cooking with the debuffs. And we're just going to farm. Because they can't hurt me in their debuff multiple times. So we've got it low enough where I think the Vig can die to a variety of things. Yeah, rock slide away. So, yo, hey, what's up, Imp, with the Prime? It's been a while, friend. Roll that beautiful butt footage for the Prime sub. Thank you kindly. I really appreciate it. Appreciate the five months. Let's go. Uh, I should be Shadow Balling here because Double Shadow Ball is a much more reliable thing to do. But I'm going to actually just Double Scorching Sands for the stat manipulation. <laughs> Right? That's fine. I wasn't worried about that. I was worried about the, uh, I was worried about the, the swapping. We still have a Vig alive, right? And then, oh my god, they're double fucking counter. Oh, there's Skarmory double counter. We just have nothing for Obama Snow to do. Not really, right? I just don't think I can kill this thing. Like, I think we would need... I'm not shielding because, like, they're going to get another move anyway. I don't think an energy ball kills them, so I think we need to go Icy Wind to try and mitigate the damage they're outputting. At least a little bit. We have to shield this and win the race to another move, right? That move has to kill. 
Which I don't know if it will. Oh. Good catch, opponent. I mean, it's a great catch, but also it just puts us in an unwinnable situation because, like, we're not going to be able to uh, survive the fast move pressure here. Obama Snow just an absolute useless Pokemon in this matchup, right? All three Pokemon beat Obama Snow. There's just not, there's not a winning, there's not a winning setup for us there. <laughs> Our other Pokemon aren't that good, right? Our other Pokemon aren't that good. All good. Uh, we've got an Obama Snow Mirror, which is fine because we this is our only option to try and win. We have to eliminate the Obama Snow up front, so we're gonna we're gonna sell out a little bit in this case. Because uh, did they get their icy wind an entire turn before me? Oh, it's Weather Ball. Okay, good. I was like, hold up, that doesn't that doesn't work. Okay, it's Weather Ball. It's fine. Everything's right in the world. Things are fine. I don't like being behind a shield, but I think we just have to do it this way, right? I think we have to do it this way. And we have to hope that our back line presents a problem for our opponent. Okay, well, we're we're doing the same thing we did last time, which is we're uh, gonna just make sure that we uh, put our palace sand onto this. I wouldn't be surprised if their remaining Pokemon was a lantern, so I'm gonna switch. I really can't imagine they're just gonna stay put here with the icy wind on them, but maybe they will. Maybe they will. Maybe this is maybe this is their best wish cash counter. Who knows? Or if their back Pokemon is Talonflame, I'm going to be very sad. So they're shielding this now. Give me another drop. There's another drop too, so that's good. It is Lantern, so we're right. We were right about what their last Pokemon was, so that's good. The question I have for myself here is do I have enough... Uh, health on the Obama snow for it to matter because ideally what we were setting up here was a scenario where maybe we could do something with that but I think we're just gonna have to uh, trust that palisand can just get through everything now Yeah, we CMP'd there. I do love me some attack drops though. That's been pretty that's been pretty consistently good for us, right? Okay. Yeah, the the thing is is that they just fell for that. They just fell for that trap. <laughs> Cause I'm pretty sure I'm gonna win CMP, and I'm pretty sure the Vigoroth can't kill me. So we're just gonna come out of this now with a charge move all i need to do is get to two scorching sands and then we're good to go right they fell for the trap Boop. ggs okay that was fun Palisand really, uh, really pulled its weight there for us. That was neat. We had one loss, and that loss was to a team that triple countered Obama Snow. So you know what? <laughs> I think that's okay. I think that's okay. It is what it is. GG's everyone. Uh, what's up, Slat? Cheers, brother. Nobody. Thanks for the uh, thanks for the fun recommendation. I really enjoyed it, and I'll probably keep playing it for a bit.